the work of the portal creators, the network of monoliths, huge power structures and the number of walls and doors surrounding them. I still can't figure out how it all connects. Hmm. Okay. Damn. Oh, hello. I just noticed this is glowing. Can I interact with this? <laughs> Fall in! Hmm. Is there a green rock somewhere? Aha! That's what that was! Fuck. Fuck. It's too busy itching my nose. <laughs> okay, so there's that. So does this, I wonder if this powers the ring. It's not looking like it. Maybe. Because there's one on this side as well. Oh, this one's a bit different though. So where's the rock for this side? Around here. So I can hear it. Oh, at least I think I can. Hmm. Actually, wait, that could help. Like, the torch could help in finding it. This is, yeah, there's not one here. Oh, it's up there. Oh, clever. That explains why there was green on the ground. There we go. Perfecto. We just need to drag and drop this one in. Oh wait, fuck, oh, come on dude, come on man, there we go, pressing all the wrong buttons. <gasps> Are you serious? There you go, what the fuck, A square, can I press that with my, with my Y button? Oh, fucking hell. What did I do? What? Oh my. What the heck? Oh! Oh wait, I've just cre- just realized. He's created a path. What the shit is this? Yeah, there we go. She just skids along it. Whee! Oh my. I think that was to show me that that's what you do. Maybe. Can I skid along it like she did? Like really quick too? Not even remotely. That sucks. It really does. I would have preferred to like skid along it like she did. Super duper fast. Would have been fucking awesome. <sighs> Too much to ask. Too much to ask. Kinda of baloney. If you ask me. A fucking noise. <laughs> Alright, is she out of breath? Yep. The hell? What the fuck? The fucking fuck? Okay, so this leads down. 
We're doing the same. Yeah, it's obvious. Yeah. Okay, you don't have no thing on it. You do. Yeah. So, do this again. This is really interesting. <laughs> don't really know what the hell it means, but it's still interesting. There we go. What did we do? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? Huh. What the hell? Whoa. I am rather confused. Okay. Holy shit. Oops. Oh, right. Okay. What the hell is this? Huh. Okay. So, I get the feeling I need to make a circle out of this. Okay. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yep, just realized. Alright, so... I don't think this is gonna work, but... My idea is to move this out of the way, and then move this... Shit. There. Do these two actually hang? Hmm. I'm trying to think of how I can get this in front of them. Oh wait, I don't need to. Oh, I can just keep that where it is. Push these two back. Yeah, maybe. That's what I'm thinking. Because it, it's the only piece that will actually fit in here fully. So now that's basically out of the way. Um, I'm not entirely sure how this is going to work though. Not particularly. Shit. Uh. No, I can't actually think of it. I was going to think, like, pushing this... I can't push this one. Oh. Uh. Oh, damn that noise. Um. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't think there's enough, enough space. But I'm, I was thinking maybe they would go together. Could they? No. Not even close. Shit. Bit more of a pain. Oh, wait, I know what I can do. That's easy. Oh my god. Yep. It's literally just a matter of this. Yeah, it's actually surprisingly simple. Huh. Well, the more you know. Yeah, because I can push that all the way to that end. Now I can push this, so it's like out of the way of that. And then I can push this into where that thing was. And there you go, Bob's your uncle. Woo! Booyah! And done. Easy! It did take me a while, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I see! That actually directly was the other half of that ring. Interesting. Right, so it's going to be the same deal. 
She'll probably skid along the bloody thing. Hmm. I've not seen her. She's just going to show me a cutscene when I get close enough. Again. Probably not, because I've already seen it. So what's the point in showing me it twice? You know? Oh, never mind. Whew. She really fucking moves. And I have to move oh so slow. Yeah, I fucking do and it sucks. been an hour and 12 minutes. I think if anything this is only going to be like an hour and 45 minutes and that will be the end of the game. Ooh, I see a dock. Human. Identity of the Ancients. Our scientists have made an amazing discovery today. We had previously believed the portal creators had abandoned this planet or had been killed by the root creatures, but we were wrong. The portal creatures were merely an advanced form of the plant-like species that covers the planet. They must have colonized this world eons ago, bringing with them a variety of sister species to seed the planet and make it habitable. Actually, we believe the planet's species are less an ecosystem of individuals and more like a dense global network. To be sure, there are some larger and some smaller species, but all seem to be able to communicate through the ubiquitous, or u ubiquitous, whatever, moss, the green fire. That is so vital to, the, to life on the planet. Considering all this and how the roots can also mimic endless forms, we are clearly in the presence of a superior and extraordinarily uh, extraordinary form of life. Hmm. Indeed, sir. All oh, right, we have this one as well. Oh, right. Oh. Oh god. Oh, there she is again. Out of breath. I mean, she ain't getting up, so. Hey, cutscene! You're low on oxygen. Oh, fuck. Really? Oh my god, it's there. Ah! Uh, Oh dear. Oh god. I found my wife after searching for several days. She had fallen off some rocks while hiking and was lying unconscious in the woods near her house. I'll never forget. Uh, she was covered in leaves and there was moss or something beginning to grow on her toes. I thought of that a few years ago and made me realize how temporary our lives are. Sooner or later, we have to let go. Hmm. What the fuck? To be fair, this was the only one that was vi uh, not vibrating. That was a red light. Oh my. What the hell? Holy fuck. Wait, so am I suddenly not gonna be low on oxygen? Oh dear. <laughs> Whee! Oh, what the heck? This is weird. Come, error. Oh, okay. Why are you searching for me here? You know where I am. You left me behind years ago. You can't find me now. We're too far apart in distance and time. Okay. Weird. Am I actually able to do anything? I can't jump. So, uh... You know. Oh. Is that... Oh, it's his wife. Oh fuck. Really? 
Great. Where are you? Where are you? Keep on moving. Do, 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 do. Oh shit, that's dickish. Jesus. I don't actually know which platform she's on. Hold on, oh. I'm coming. When are they gonna fucking move again? Wait, from here? Down here again? Wait, no. Shit, I should've gone up there. Oops. Yeah, I couldn't really figure out where to go from this one. I guess over to this one though. What? No! Oh, that just sucks. Oh damn, I'm in. I have no idea. <laughs> oh great. Thankfully this works. What in the fuck? Yeah, I've still got my extended boost. Yeah, bitch. Oh, fuck yeah. That is a creepy fucking noise. Tracking the monster. That's a lot of blood. I hope she's still alive. The creature has the woman now and she's clearly been injured. Drops of the woman's blood gl glow bright green on the cabin floor. I hope she is still alive, but I can't imagine how I'll be able to help her if that monster is nearby. What in the fuck? Whatever the fuck can I do? I can't fight. I'm useless. It's also kind of creepy because it's fucking huge. Yeah, abyss. Dun dun dun. Oh shit! Really? More of these fucking things. Last thing I want to deal with is the stupid bastard plant. That I've already had to deal with so fucking much. Ooh. Oh, there's a ring again. Oh. In that nest. I still don't trust anything, so I'm like, the plants are just gonna be stood around somewhere. They'll catch me out, I can guarantee it. Wait, really? It's another one of these? Oh, there she is. She's alive, from the looks of things. Wait. They need to meet in the middle. Oh. Is that the beast? Thing. Oh god, it, it might be. I'm not sure. Is that right? Oh, there we go. We did it. Oh my. Could she not just touch it? Hmm. Because I mean, if she did, would that not destroy it? Oh damn. Or is she now turning on me? I don't know. If that's holding her hostage, or she now controls it. Oh, fuck. I think she does control it. She may have actually sacrificed herself to stop it. Ow. My wrist. Jesus. Whoa, I was supposed to where the fuck am I? Alright. So we're just seeing the aftermath. Holy fuck! Holy green. Greenlands. Oh my. Whoa. Elita's sacrifice. The woman I've been following is gone, well no, she's still here, all around me, having given herself up to the monster to save this planet. She willingly sped, uh, shared her life-saving cure at her own expense. 
I'd like to think she's more at home here, merged with this strange and beautiful ecosystem, than in the company of a lowly human being such as myself. Whatever the case, she saved my life along with countless other beings on this planet. So that was Aelita. I thought as much. It's a very weird thing though, because they converted her into a plant, essentially. Can I climb this? Guess so. I don't know. I'm like, I'm thinking maybe I can, but I'm also like, I'm not so sure. Definitely seems like this is something I can climb. Hmm. Alright. Cool. These are actually surprisingly cool. Yeah. Perfect. I just wanted to get onto this one, because it made sense. So everything should be harmless in this level, even though the music is very telling. It's like, wham, bam. I don't know, it's just playing music as if it's all a lot worse. Oh, fuck. Okay, that was almost terrible. Are you shitting me? Oh my god. There you go. There we are. My god, the music. It's a lot of green though. Look at it. All this green. I mean, if she's merged with all the plant life, then surely nothing will want to just randomly eat me. Like the plants should not want to kill me anymore. That's what I'm hoping. Is the case. Yeah. It'd be very nice. Oof. Okay. Hmm. Okay... Do I platform across these? I mean, it very much looks like I can. Or not. I mean, that's also a thing. Uh. No, I can't help but feel that I need to platform. Across them. Just because the way it's just the way it looks. Yeah. That's not gonna work. Alright. <clears throat> I do have the extended jump, so I should be fine. To do all of this? Like it should work out yeah, it should. There you go. I just need to be very careful that I don't land on a shitty part of it, because I will just fall. Well, I'll slip off and fall. There we are. Hey, very nice. Perfect. Ah, oh, satellite dish. What a weird and bizarre place for that to be. Hmm. Just seems like it's not in the right place. Whew, that was close. Ah, go! I want to inspect. I mean, it's a satellite dish. What's not to love? Oh wow, there's actually a log here. Ha! Huh. Never would have guessed. What is it? <coughs> Portal time. Portal does lead back to Earth, but hundreds of years in the future. Fucking hell. Portal time. The portal to this planet was a one-way transport, transport mechanism, as we discovered following our initial arrival. We originally assumed it would work like any doorway that we could return through the same portal device at our convenience, but this was not the case. Thankfully, we eventually discovered the second portal, the departure portal. 
leading back home. This two-portal system was actually very efficient for transport purposes, and we developed our settlements appropriately to regulate travel back and forth as necessary. But what we didn't comprehend at first was the lost time encountered through the portals. While transport happens quickly, time on Earth and on this planet are not in sync. We soon realized a week on this world was a month back on Earth. When the portals failed, this time disparity became great. When the arrival portal malfunctioned and killed so many people, we became afraid to use the departure portal to return to Earth. Over time, we started to see images we did not recognize on the other side. Much more advanced than anything we'd ever seen before, some believed the portal had recalibrated to the homeworld of the portal creators. But I knew the truth. The images in the portal were of Earth, but centuries in the future. Unfortunately, we never tested our hypothesis. Given the completely unstable power reactions from the portal, it was far more likely we would suffer a tragic transportation accident, like our comrades from home attempting to reach us. There were no volunteers and eventually no further opportunities before the portal went dark and cold. In retrospect, I wish we'd taken our chances. I mean, you'd have gone, you'd, you'd have gotten back home. The downside to that is the fact you'd have gotten back home without... Uh, you'd have got back home hundreds of years in the future. But is that such a bad thing? <gasps> oh dear. Either way, not too bad. This pot, uh, this planet actually seems to have atmosphere now. It's a very green planet. It's a purely green planet. Oh my, I see it. Whoa. That thing's fucking huge. Huh. Weird. Oh my god, is that her? Oh, it is! Ah, I kind of... Uh, I can't. I was gonna say, I kind of want to go over to her, but I can't. She's just basically a tree. She is an Ent! Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I called one of the enemies earlier in the game an Ent. Because it looked like her and turned into a tree. It's like, you know, the Ents are tree people. She has actually become an Ent. And that's actually one that's, like, more accurately represented. Like, that's the size of them. I don't really know what the size of them actually is, but... I know they're pretty damn tall. Yeah. Ugh. Oh. Do, 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 do. Dun, 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 dun. There it is. Ah. So our entire mission was basically get back home. After so long. Even though everybody we know and love is probably dead. It's a hundred years. What the fuck? I don't even recognize what the hell that's meant to be or where that's meant to be. Boy, <laughs> what a name! That name, noise. You've kept your wife on life support. It sounds like you haven't been able to let her go. Actually, I did it for her. I want to give her every chance to live again, even if I'm not here. Okay. Oh wow. Wait, so is this Earth? Are we back on Earth? What the fuck? Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> There's an invisible wall preventing me from killing myself. What the fuck? That did not look like no Earth. Hey, a lifeless planet. That game was actually pretty damn good. I mean, yeah, it was a game that was nothing but platforming and puzzles, but that doesn't really matter. It doesn't- a game doesn't have to have combat to be a good game. Yeah, I enjoyed that. There's a lot of issues- well, not issues, um... The only problem I really had with the game was sometimes the jumping mechanic is a bit iffy. 
And also, as I said earlier, with the pushing stuff, like that just, it's really weird. But, um, no, it was. Oh, pardon me. Towards the end of last session, a jumping put not puzzle. There was a bunch of platforming you had to do over plants that wanted to kill you, basically. And yeah, that was frustrating because it didn't work out very well. There we go. A lifeless planet. That was a fun game. Okay. I don't think I can skip it, but to be fair, I don't think there's anything after the credits, so there's that. Anyway, that is going to be the end of Lifeless Planet. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this adventure. And until next time, take care.